Reclamation is unique in our large dams, but we're not unique in the world. There are other countries that have very large structures. Um, a lot of these structures have um, concrete that's made with aggregate up to um, eight or nine inches, like at Hoover Dam, um, or down to even maybe uh, three or four inches, which is maybe more, more standard for a dam. Um, but there's not a lot of ways to evaluate concrete that has that large of an aggregate in there. Here in the materials lab, we can help evaluate the material properties of these large dams for ourselves and for other entities. And um, they, there really is nowhere else in the world for them to come to for these services. Reclamation has long had an international affairs program, um, probably going back to the 1950s. Um, essentially, Reclamation has a lot of expertise in a whole variety of areas related to water resources management, um, dam safety, sedimentation, planning, design, and construction. And these areas of expertise are not just well known, but desired and needed by, by other countries. Essentially, Reclamation has, I'd say, unique expertise in the area of materials, materials testing, and that uh, is recognized by a lot of folks in the U.S. and also, in some cases, overseas. Uh, in the case of this program right now, we've got a, uh, a dam that has a lot of uh, rehabilitation needs. They want materials testing, and so we've got a fairly substantial program, like a six-month program, to look at um, a number of large samples to assess the, uh, the safety factor. We're working on a project where we look at a dam um, and its material properties. We are looking to determine the strength of the concrete in both compression and tension. So concrete uh, is good in compression. That's when we um, basically squeeze the concrete in place. And we would do that typically on this machine behind me as our um, large machine up to five million pounds. The compression tests that we do on the large diameter cylinders are essentially the same as on a smaller, typical six inch diameter specimen that we use in everyday construction. Um, we grind or cap both sides um, of the specimen to make sure that it's plain and perpendicular and we put it into our uh, compression machine and load it uh, vertically until failure. Um, we also test concrete in tension, which is when you pull the concrete apart. And um, as most of us know, you can walk on concrete pretty easily, but we don't use it for, um, for tensile members very often um, because it's very low in, in tensile strength. Um, it's those low strengths that we really need to be um, estimating or predicting correctly so that when we evaluate a dam on a whole, we know that it will be able to withstand whichever uh, tensile loads are put on the dam. Um, and that they don't exceed the, the strength of the concrete in that property, which it's inherently weak in. The Bureau of Reclamation is one of the world leaders in direct tension testing of concrete. Um, Reclamation's experience in doing this type of tensile testing um, has made it possible for us to work not only on our own projects, but on projects for other countries and other um, entities. If other countries are interested in expertise and assistance from reclamation, uh, there's a variety of ways they can contact us. Uh, it could be a letter to the commissioner, a very formal letter asking for assistance in the area uh, of need. It could be through an internet uh, uh, query um, or uh, contacting a reclamation employee at a conference. Um, in general, it's uh, through formal, but we have occasionally informal requests for assistance.